from taking longer routes to hurling vulgarities or simply talking too much. Ten irksome traits of taxi drivers were compiled and published in a new book titled Taxi Tales in Singapore, which was launched on Friday. Razor TV took to the streets to find out what are the worst cabbing experiences passengers have had to put up with. Uh, I'm actually leaving from Toby Court area. Yeah, after a movie, so it was probably about one to two a.m. And then uh, I was uh, taking a cab uh, with my friend. You know, we go to Aukang first. So after that, uh, the taxi driver actually dozed off halfway. So the taxi was swerving left and right. You know, me and my friends were actually talking on the on, in the cab lah. So we found there's something weird, you know, with the taxi swerving left and right. So when I was looking at the the mirror, I saw the taxi driver actually dozing off. So we had to walk him aside, you know. So he, he said that he's okay, he's okay, and he keep on driving. So I was like, okay, uncle, you can just stop there, and then we just left. <laughs> yeah. So it's uh, pretty a scary experience for me, lah. Yeah. There was once I booked a taxi early in the morning. And I saw the taxi opposite side. I waved to him. He went to somewhere and picked up somebody. I saw with my own eyes. <laughs> I was very disappointed. <laughs> I have to book another taxi. Some you see the PT problem. Like if you if you want to use nets, they say that um, the nets process takes about few days, so ask you to pay by cash or that. Did he scold you when he demanded you pay cash or what? Um, demand with a with a very bad attitude lah. I say why is a machine I can't use, and you insist of paying cash, then you must well don't use the machine, <laughs> don't put the machine there. So. Some of them they don't ask which way you prefer to go. Even like you when you get onto the cab, you said where you wish to go. They don't acknowledge you. <laughs> sometimes because the place I stay is Serangoon North, but sometimes they mistaken. They said Serang. They thought I'm going Serangoon. So I said no. I said Serang. I'm going. Definitely, I know where I stay, right? I said oh, because you didn't mention, you didn't say properly. I told him to go one way, but he took another route. Yeah. So. Did, did you ask end, him why he took yeah. a different? He said he he said that he he didn't know that there's such a route. So I, uh, a bit surprised, you know, as a taxi driver, you don't even know your the way through. But was it a longer route than what yeah, you suggested? It's a, long, it's a longer route, like about a dollar fifty more. Yeah. Other irksome traits of taxi drivers include body odor, or those who kick up a fuss when they receive a big note during payment. Fortunately, not all cabbies are bad. Learn how some taxi drivers left a good impression on their passengers, and pick up some handy tips to improve your chances of getting a taxi in the next clip.